Здраво, здраво, како секогаш, така и овој пат се наоѓаме на местото во Сторството и вие гледате Хартен Хеви, а покрај мене е новиот соговорник. Станува збор за еден култен бенд, станува збор за бенд кој е пионир на Дет Метал, станува збор за бенд кој не доаѓа од Соединетите Американски држави, станува збор за бендот од Флорида Обучари. First, uh, welcome to the TV Macedonian show, Hard and Heavy. Oh, thank you. Yeah. How are you? Oh, nice. My gl uh, to, to be the glade when they're talking to you. I see three times. Uh, I see working interview before four years. And now to meeting you. And uh, cool. uh, tell me, uh, how you started? Because you started many years and you be the pioneer of death metal. <laughs> I don't have a poem of what is to be in meeting the death metal. How would how we begin? Yeah, in the beginning. Uh, just Too many years. Well, I mean, uh, like Donald, John, and myself were friends. We were children, you know, in a neighborhood yeah. close to each other and played soccer and baseball together and yeah. went to school together started listening to music together and and um, we found metal you know Iron Maiden Black Sabbath Slayer Celtic Frost Hellhammer you know that that's what started it really I mean in the beginning because we were like we all love this music in general all music and um and one day we started learning how to play instruments, so it was perfect. It was a perfect storm. <laughs> yeah, it's a simple, it's a normal, only cleaning that metal. And uh, we're taking the influence for your music for all the bands because there the exists the death metal. Right, uh, we loved, I mean, like I said, we, Black Sabbath, loved Black Sabbath and uh, old uh, classic rock, even like Led Zeppelin and uh, uh, Deep Purple, Rainbow, uh, Jimi Hendrix, um, yeah. and then you know, like I said, Iron Maiden, that kind of stuff, and made us want to play Ozzy Osbourne, and you know, so that was the beginning for us to want to play music in general. And then I remember hearing uh, Hellhammer. Yeah. When I heard Hellhammer, I was like, that's it. This is what I want to play. This heavy, fucked up shit. <laughs> really. When I started that battle, you started to be a pioneer. I respect <laughs> you. And we're talking to, to another relaxing interview now. And uh, too many years, too many bands where they started with the extra uh, metal flag that don't exist. Uh, Obituary is here. Obituary to many here, they have the new material, they exist. Awesome. We are taking the power to exist. You are very uh, strong together because uh, two brothers uh, and your band. Uh, you are just like a brother together. You know, oh, yeah. So, we, huh? oh yeah, we're, we, like I said, we've been friends since uh, like 1980. Yeah. So 38 years we've been friends. So yeah. we are brothers, we're family. Just like and and we enjoy to create really heavy music you know it's a fun thing for us yeah. so and today is very polished and we when we create a new song it's from the heart you know we're like okay we're gonna make a song that's gonna be fucking sick <laughs> you know yeah. so and we've been together that long so it's like chemistry you know yeah, yeah. very cool we had to be very younger and we had to listen to your first album. Your lyrics is be only kill, kill, die, die, blood. Yeah. And well, after you uh, the, the, the have the many lyrics, who write the lyrics and we are taking the experience. Now you are, for me, we had started and now you are the better, the better, the better, the better, the better when you're older. Uh, well, John does the lyrics stuff yeah. and but the ideas all come from like when we were children we loved uh horror movies you know like it was fun to watch like evil dead and 
that stuff. So that was always an influence for the ideas behind the music, uh, lyrically and visually, you know. Basically, death metal for me and us is uh, like a, a horror movie, but as an album, you know. Yeah. So that's what we try to create, like a good, scary Stephen King movie or something, you know, that's crazy, weird, but music, you know. That's what the idea is, basically. Death Metal started in Florida, from the USA. Uh, started with Chuck Schuldiner, Dad, and Obituary. You'll be the pioneer. Why don't you have uh, uh, USA? It's a uh, big bazaar. They have many people, 300 millions, and after uh, with the illegals, many uh, 40,000 millions. Uh, why don't you have uh, that metal uh, or heavy metal in just like here in Europe, the festivals? I don't know, it's strange. Um, it, well, in, in America, it's like I think commercial, commercial music is so popular and people love the commercial music. And it's really strange. I, I don't know why we don't have like a festival season. You know, it's yeah. it's. I don't. It's hard to explain. I don't get it. Because um, people love heavy metal in America. You know, like there's a big metal scene in America. It's massive. But no one organizes the the metals like uh, festivals. Yeah, yeah. I mean, they'll have like a a tour of a bunch of bands, and it works really good. But like for festivals, individuals, it's it's weird. I don't know. It's it's a strange, it's a strange phenomenon. <laughs> yeah, it's to know. Yeah. I think so. Uh, maybe the uh, businessman, the promotion to see one DJ say to pay to uh, very cheap, right? Or uh, one band who is the five six uh, members to be. <laughs> right, right. Yeah. yeah. No, 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 I don't know. It's weird. Maybe. Yeah. Very strange. Yeah. Yeah. And uh, you have a uh, new material, we uh, promotion you, uh, uh, many songs for the new material who is coming and tell me where the recording uh, him. Uh, well, we have, uh, we built like, the last um, let me see, one, two, about 10 years ago, we built our own studio. We, the, the place we rehearse, we, we purchased a Pro Tools studio, so we record ourselves. So all the recordings now are done in our studio, and um, we have this last album, the self-titled album, we have uh, a friend of ours do the mix. He lives up in New York, uh, Long Island area, and he did the mix, Joe Sincata. So, but yeah, we do all the retracking and recording ourselves. So, because we're technologically cohesive so it's like why not just record it ourselves we know what it's supposed to sound like yeah. we buy all the microphones we bought the machines everything we need to make this happen so yeah. so it's beautiful yeah. do you exist the project of the brothers uh, Teddy uh, the Tardy brothers yeah, yeah I think uh, I think Donald and John are they're slowly creating new music for this mm -hmm. so yeah I think yeah definitely yeah eventually one day there'll be another one a second, yeah. Who is the plan in the future for Butchery? Uh, well, the next step. Well, we're uh, just we're supporting the new album, which is already over a year old now. But actually, we're gonna do the Slayer tour coming in November. Mm -hmm. uh, we're gonna tour with Slayer, Anthrax, Lamb of God. It's gonna be nice. that's a very uh, a wonderful thing for us as uh, fans and and musicians to actually do a tour with Slayer for us is like a like a lifetime dream so <laughs> this is gonna be very cool <laughs> then we'll do that in November and uh, we got some other stuff we're gonna we got a small American tour coming up next month and then we're gonna um, I mean as far as a new album right now nothing's planned I mean I'm always creating new ideas for music so that's always happening every day, or not every day, but you know what I mean, yeah. all the time. Yeah. Uh, like one day I'll be doing sound check for a show and maybe I'll come up with an idea yeah. and I'll record it real fast on my phone just to remember the idea. Yeah. So that's always happening. But yeah, so Slayer Tour, I think we have a thing in America we're gonna do early next yeah. year, so. Always touring. Always. Yeah, every 
in the lazy because you're bringing it younger and you have yeah. this drunk and death battle. Yeah, exactly. We're bringing it to the fans, yeah. always. So. Yeah, always. They're respecting yeah. you. Yeah. Like you're a pioneer. You're the only person survival to make it yeah. in the year. Uh, and for the end, what would like to say? And uh, what is your message for Macedonian metal fans and people who are watching this interview? I hope one day we come to Macedonia. It yeah. would be fucking sick. Yeah. And thank you for the support. And thank you. And it's metal will live forever. And we know this today. Yeah. It's been going on for a long time. You can't kill it. <laughs> yeah. And this is the last. You can't kill the dead. Yeah. 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 Listen to Death Metal if you like it, Master Metal. <laughs> you must be sure the pioneer of heavy metal. Blood and dirty. Death Metal. <laughs> yeah. And kill. Yeah, thank you.